doing another Keep It Simple Stupid episode and this time we've got um, somebody quite special, um, Mr. Jim Epper. Now, for those of you who don't know who Jim Epper is, Jim Epper is a long time big carp angler. He's fished with some of the greats, one of my heroes, Rod Hutchinson. Um, so, you know, what Jim says goes, basically. <laughs> So over to you Jim, he's going to do us um, just a couple of basic rigs um, and you know if you use these sort of rigs just about, they'll catch fish just about anywhere. Right, thanks Del for that lovely introduction, I obviously don't deserve it but here we go. Um, he's asked me to tie a basic rig and just a knot maybe that most people haven't heard of or haven't used. I find it a better loop knot than the figure of eight and I'll tie both of them and show you the difference. Um, it's called the perfection loop knot, easy peasy to tie. Uh, for this we're going to use um, a piece of, because most of my rigs are combi rigs, uh, using a semi stiff material and then a, a very uh, pliable braid. Um, this is the semi stiff material at the moment, thinking anglers stuff, um, and we tie perfection. Easy. Make a loop, first loop, make a two loops, second loop. Now this loop will be your actual loop on the knot. When you've got to that situation, you bring the tag end through between the two loops. And because my poor tired old eyes don't work very well these days, I pull it through a baiting needle. There's your loop. Now all you've got to do is separate moisten and pull. It is as simple and as straightforward as that. And if you pull that snug it down nice and tight, that will never ever move. And you'll notice that it comes directly off of the, of the stiff link. Trim the tag end. You obviously don't have to steam this at some stage or another, but that's your loop knot and that's the perfection. It's so easy to tie and so much neater than what I'm going to show you now. Right, we're now going to tie the figure of eight loop knot. Again, a very, very strong knot, don't get me wrong, but not as neat and not as tidy. And in a lot of ways, the bulk is the downfall of this knot. Bring it round. I won't, I'll show you this very quickly. It's not, everybody knows a figure of eight loop knot. It's not something new snug it down and you'll see the difference lovely neat little knot on your left my right and the figure of eight and you'll notice the figure of eight doesn't come up directly off of the main line it comes off at a loop so you've really got to steam the hell out of that which obviously is going to weaken the line so we throw that away it's rubbish 